Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. It's Jessica. Hope you've all been doing well. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. It's very much appreciated. In today's video, I have a lot of motivation for you. I will only be cleaning two rooms, my master bedroom and my laundry room, but they are both just out of there. Like I have things everywhere. My laundry room is so small and I'm constantly just throwing things in there and it's insane. So today you'll be getting a lot of motivation in the laundry room and also in my master bedroom. So sit back and enjoy. A quick shout out to Amber from Boss Mom Hustle. I purchased some of her merch. I got this shirt, it's so cute, so comfy. You can dress it up and dress it down, honestly. I'm looking forward to it getting a little cooler outside so I can throw a cardigan over it. Although the laundry room is super dirty, my main focus in here today was to move the washer and dryer as much as I could so I can clean up some Tide that spilt in the back of the dryer. And the way that the washer and dryer are connected, um, there is a, um, a tube, I guess you can say, that is going from the washer to the dryer for the steaming process. So I can only move it forward so far, but that's my main focus today. And you'll see here in a little bit that um, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to clean up all that soap that fell back there. So there it is. That's all the tide that fell back there. So I really need to get that cleaned up. So I tried to use the vacuum to pick up all the dust back there and I quickly realized that that's not going to work. So I'm going to get my old cedar mop and I am going to uh, start mopping it back there. As you can see, even after mopping, it was still really dusty back there. Now I'm going to start taking everything off the granite so I can give that a good wipe down. Um, a lot of the things up there were just, I think they were like two orders from Grove that I just needed to, um, put up and don't come at me for these downy beads. I mean, I love downy beads. They make me happy, but my grocery store Kroger was having a sale. If you buy five, you save more. So I bought five. I already had the big one there and I bought five of the little ones. So you know, if you have to buy more to save money, let's save money. You know, that's what it's all about. I think I was saving like almost $2 on each one. So I was like, yes, I'm for that.
Now I'm sure some of you know that I'm about to put some water in that Thai bottle, shake it up and pour it in the washer because no soap left behind. So after dusting the washer and dryer, I'm gonna wipe it down um, with the Mrs. Myers Acorn Spice. Again, that's my favorite one. That's the one I've been using for the past month. Not the same bottle, but just the same scent. And that's what I'm just gonna use down to wipe down the washer. The washer really needed a good wipe down. Um, I know that I can do better, but I did have a load in there, so I was limited to like trying to move the, what is it called? The tub, I guess where all the clothes are in. Um, so I just wiped down everything as much as I could, but later that night, whenever I was done with the laundry, I put in one of those Tide washing machine packages and I went ahead and wiped everything that I could on the inside. I was able to move it a little bit more. So this, my friends, is a real life moment. This is Jessica destroying her house to clean her house. And what I mean by that is my husband was out of the country and when he left, I made a list of things that I wanted to do. And one of those things was to set up the bed frame that I had in the living room in my last video. So Natalie and I did put that together and in the process, I made a bigger mess in my room. So. Today, I am getting rid of everything that I had in my bedroom from putting that together and then going ahead and everything that I had around the vanity and the dresser in my room, they were boxes of shoes that needed to be put in the closet. As you can see, um, the bed is higher than the bed frame. Um, the bed was too heavy for Natalie and I to adjust the leg, so we had to wait for Urayi to return so we can um, adjust the legs on the bed. So this day was actually the day before I cleaned the laundry room and that is why I still have a lot of cleaning products right here in my bedroom because um, when I was cleaning out the laundry room, I was bringing the things in here instead of having them right there on the floor in the hallway. Lucky, lucky, lucky So after recording this video and even my husband mentioning it before, this wall right here looked too crowded with everything that was there. And honestly, I didn't even use my vanity. So I decided to go ahead and take it apart and I'm using it in my closet. So my vanity is no longer there. I mean, I never really sat there to do my makeup. I honestly did my makeup 
standing up in the restroom because the lighting was better so for me to take it down and put it away it didn't bother me too much but it's still being used as storage for my makeup The duster that I'm using is from Grove Collaborative. I really like it because it's washable. You can reuse it as many times and you can also buy refills for it. I don't have a link for it or anything like that, but a lot of the other YouTubers that I'm sure you watch too, if you use their links, then you can go ahead and um, purchase that. And I believe, I don't know if it's everyone, but you get free gifts when you first sign up. So y'all should really check that out because Grove does have a lot of things that you can reuse many times and that saves us so much money because although i still use swiffer for certain things um it adds up when you're buying the same thing over and over so i check it out So I'm quickly showing you how dirty the mirror is. It has Jacob's little fingerprints all over it. And after I showed it, I started cleaning it and somehow I lost the footage. But I'm sure when you continue watching the video, you'll see that the mirror had been wiped down.
so one thing I've noticed in my home is that the cologne bottles and the perfume bottles are best friends with dust. I swear there's dust on these things all the time. I can clean it on a Monday and by Wednesday it looks like I haven't cleaned in a whole week. Like it's incredible how much the dust collects. I'm not sure what it is, but I feel like I am very slow this year when it comes to getting all my fall decor out. It's like, I don't understand what's going on with me, but I am honestly still putting things up for fall. And then my boys are asking me to decorate for Halloween, which is something I've never done. And I'm like, dude, I'm just now getting done trying to decorate for fall and then I would have to take it all down to decorate for Halloween and then put it back up again for November. Oh my goodness. So I decided to go with all white for my new bedding um i did purchase these pack of sheets from marshall's and the comforter i purchased from home goods As you can see, I keep on moving the comforter around. I don't know if it's because the bed already looked kind of funny because it was too high and I felt like the comforter didn't fit the bed. But now that the bed has been lowered, the comforter is like, it's perfect. I guess it was just because it was too high so the comforter looked like it was small. We have now reached the end of the video. If you watched all the way to the end, you rock. Comment a fall leaf emoji down below to let me know you're still here. Thank you so much 
for watching, for clicking on today's video, for being a loyal subscriber. If you're new to my channel, you know, just stopping by for the first time on this video, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Miss Jessie underscore J. Again, I appreciate you all so much and I'll see you in the next one. Love you all. Bye.